a lot of them still sinking in. To be honest, yeah, um, you know, my, my, my boys talk about it all the time. Um, I get stopped in the in the Wigan street and people keep talking about their fake cup and how much it meant to them. So, yeah, for me as a as, as a player at the time and the captain to lift up that trophy, uh, it was a magnificent feeling and and something that you know it can live me forever. When you look back at those pictures and and you browse through all the stuff that's in the stadium that shows how we won the FA Cup, what's what's your first cup feeling? Just um. I have to pinch myself, to be honest, yeah. I still can't believe it's true. Um, it was, I remember at the time, it was, a, it was a mixed feelings with, you know, obviously winning this cup, but then trying to concentrate on a, on a game a couple of days later. So, um, you know, I could spend the scenes in change rooms. Um, I missed half of it because I had to go for a drug test. <laughs> so, um, but no, it was uh, obviously seeing the chairman come in, um, the players dancing around, and um, just having that, you know, seeing our fans celebrating with them, it was, uh, you know, it was excellent and you know, a feeling that's you know, out of this world. You played Bournemouth in the first game in the third round and have they done it again this season playing Bournemouth? I mean, fairy tales can happen, we've shown that. How far do you think the lads can go this year? I was, I was talking to someone a, a while ago and it's amazing how the two fortunes of the clubs have turned around. Obviously Bournemouth were the league one at the time, I think they were, and obviously Wigan were fighting relegation. And, um, and it sort of like switched around. But um, yeah, my memories then was going to that game, you know, not thinking too much because um, the first game they should have beat us. And obviously we had the return game where Borselli come out and scored that one goal. And um, yeah, it was, it was more or less straight through. So it goes to show that, you know, anything can happen. And to our boys now, just keep playing as each game goes long and, you know, see where the journey ends. They'll go into it with absolutely no fear of beating the Premier League team already and there's a couple of injuries for West Ham. Do you expect a, a big game here and a big atmosphere here? It's going to be a, it's going to be a typical FA Cup type show. Yeah, as I said before, you know, we're going to go into the game full of confidence. Hopefully the fans will come out and support them. Um, and after the Bournemouth game, I think West Ham will look at it a bit differently in terms of the team they put out. Um, because, you know, obviously Wigan were fantastic in that game against Bournemouth. So I'm sure the West Ham won't take this game lightly. Um, and Wigan will go out there full of confidence and try and get the result they need.